Hello and welcome back to channel Tea Lovers. So if you are new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel and also do not forget to click on our bell icon for our latest update. Today also I am back with you bringing a new topic for you. So in the topic of today, I have a next part for previous video. As in the previous video, I have made a video how you can get a free domain for your blogger purpose. And this is the video that you can see in the screen. You can go for it and you can get a free domain for your website. And in this video, I'll show you how you can connect this domain with your blogger. So do not skip any part of this video so that you can connect this domain to your blogger. So do not skip any part of this video so that you can connect your domain with the blogger and get the custom domain on your website. Besides this, if you are totally new visitor on our channel, then our channel provides you the free domain hosting, free SSL certificate, including the free traffic for your website, which is very essential for the AdSense approval for your website. So if you do not have any idea how to create a website, then we have tutorial video regarding this topic also. Or we have a lot of content regarding the text or AI content that will make your work very easier and faster. Please connect with us by subscribing and leaving the comment in the comment section below. Besides all this, if you got any error and problem regarding the monetization and adsense error, then you can directly contact on tlover2054 in the Instagram that I have shown in the screen also. I'll give you support that is totally free and you can DM me without any problem. And this is my website which will provide you the lot of knowledge about the tech and other imp So without wasting our time, let's move for the today's content to connect your blogger with the domain. So first of all, to connect the blogger, you need the previous domain name that I have already told you that you can get the free domain name using this video. I'll put this link in the description below also so that you can get this video freely and you can use this video to get your free domain name. So I'm in the blogger website. So this is the totally new blogger that I have recently created. You can find the option for the custom domain name. So when you click on the custom domain, you need some URL of your custom domain. So for that, we'll go for the previous website domains.1 to get our free domain name URL. Okay, so we'll just go for this website. As I have already teach you how you can get the free domain, please check this video in my channel. So this is the website which will provide you the free domain. I have already made a video regarding this. I have already told you. Now I'll just go for the login as I have already signed up in the website and get a free domain. I just put my login credentials so that I can login in this website. Here you can see that I have successfully provided my login detail and I'll just click on the login to go further for this website. And you can see that I am in the dashboard of this website from where I can manage all this domain. So I'll just click on the my services. So in this dashboard, I have one domain name and there is domain DNS. So I'll just click on the domain DNS to create the DNS setup for the blogger. So just click on the domain DNS. If you haven't got the domain, I suggest you to go for my video and get a new domain. Now we are in the DNS control panel of this website and this is the domain name. Okay. So this is the random domain name that I have took on the previous video. You can use your custom domain name right over here. And this extension are there are four or five extension free extension. You can choose any extension. So I have just choose the org.gd by which my work will be easier. Okay. So this is the domain name. Copy the domain name of your and just go for the blogger setting to add a custom domain name paste over it. So this is the setting they have provided and we have to enter this setting in the domain dns management okay so here we have the two cname record we have to enter this two cname record in the free domain name to connect this domain with the blogger so this is the cname record name just copy it after that you have to just go for the free domain name so here is the option for the cname record so this is the cname record you have to just go for the edit after that you have to just provide the alliance as www and as it is already pasted over here you can just leave it as it is you have to change TTL for one hour. Now the point to host it is external host. So we do not need to host on this same website. So just click on the external host and just go for the blogger and copy this destination of ghs.google.com. After that, copy this link and paste in the external host link. After pasting this, you have to just click on the update allies. As you can see that our one CNAME record has been added. Now we'll add next CNAME record. So for that, you have to just click on the add alliance. Now the second part is here. This is your personal domain name. So please keep this domain name very safe in a world. You might need this domain name. So this is the actual CNAME name of your website. So copy this CNAME record and destination in some of your old file and keep this safe for your user also. Paste in the alliance. After that, you have to change the TTL for one hour. And for the point to host it, you have to just click on the external host. So you have to copy for the destination. This is the destination part. 
After you have done this thing, you have to just click on the add allies. As you can see that we have added two CNM record over here. So for saving this, you have to just scroll down and click on the save changes. Finally, you can see that your two CNM record has been added right over here. Next thing is you need for this website is host IP address. So for that, you have to just click on the edit also. That is A and A A A records. Now next thing you need in this website is host record. That is IP address IP before or IPv6. So for that you have to just click on the edit button on the right screen and I'll show you how you can get this IP. So just click on the edit first. Now as before you have to use that TTL as the one hour. Now you have to just go for the blogger place again and you can find the link of support page link. So right click and open link in a new tab or you can open this link in a same tab also. So you have to just go for this page and you can find the IP address like this. So you have to set all these A records one by one. So copy this and go for the free DNS management. So you have to paste all these four IP. After you set up these four IPs on your website, you have to just click on the submit to save this setting. So just click on the submit. Now after you have successfully done this, you have to again click on the save changes right on the screen so that you can save this setting for your website. So just click on the save changes. Finally, we have updated the host record. We have updated the allies record. Now we need .txt record to be updated. So for that you have to just go for my website. You can find the file in my website so that you can update this .txt file in this free DNS management. So just click on this post. So this is the post. I'll provide this link in the description below. Or if you do not get this post link, you have to just go for the home. And on the right screen you can find the topic for the free tech section. So in that section you can find the connect free domain with the blogger. And you can find this post. So in this post, scroll down and I have pasted the link for that downloading option. So this is the link. Click on it and you can find a file in G drive. So this is the G drive file. You can just download this file or you can manually update from here. Okay. We have already updated the DNS AAA record. So we'll just scroll down. We have already updated the CNAME record also. Here I have just provided the one CNAME record that is common for all. The next part is your website CNAME record is available and this is different in every website. So please use your own CNAME record and destination. Okay. And the final TXT record is here. So just copy this. And final TXT record is this. So just copy this link and you have to just go for the free domain again. And you can find the txt record option so just click on the add txt and here you have to paste like this as you have successfully paste you need to provide your blog id in this option so this is the txt record that you have to put in the dns management of free domain but before that you need to make changes on this txt record okay so here i have provided the two red text in which you have to provide your blog id your own blog id and next one is your domain name okay so these two are different so i have put this thing in a red mark okay so we we'll just copy the blog id you can find your blog id in the setting option you have to just go for your blog so this is the blog post and in the setting option you can find the blog in the url of your website so this is your blog id you have to paste your blog id in this option replace this blog id option with your blog id number so like this so this is your blog id and next one is domain so you have to provide the domain that need to be posted in your blog or connected in your blog so this is the domain name that i want to connect in my blog so copy this domain name and you have to paste this domain name without www and without https okay so paste like this as i have shown in the screen as you can see that this link will be like this and here you have to provide your blog id and here you have to provide your the domain name as i have shown in the screen so just copy this and paste in the dot txt file now on the txt name just go for the www and change the ttl for one hour and you can just go for the add txt so finally we have added the txt file also this is here and you have to just click on the save changes to save this setting so just click on that save changes if you got any error in this method you have to change the name of this www to txt while saving this record okay so you can just add this txt file like this after setting all this uh, you need some time to hold right here so after doing all these things you have to hold for some time because 
for setting of your DNS, it requires 72 hours for setting your DNS and connecting your domain with your blogger. So it may take some time. So after some hour, if you just go for the blogger setting and just click on the save or you can just try it after 24 hours using your custom domain name and you can just click on the save and your option will be saved right over here as it is showing that it is not able to update right now because the system has not detected or updated this domain name or C name record in our domain name so it will take some time wait for this to update it for 24 hours to 72 hours so that dns record on your blogger will connect it to the custom domain so after doing all this you can add your custom domain in the blog sport okay so if you got any error any question regarding this you can directly contact on t lover 2054 in the instagram that i have shown in the screen also so this is how you can connect your blogger with the free domain name and i'll provide you the all the necessary document file link in the description below so that you can access for this file and website so that you can connect your blogger with the custom domain name this is how you can connect your free domain with the blogsport.com okay please try this after 24 to 72 hours to get updated and if you like the video please hit on the like option do not forget to click on the subscribe and bell icon for our latest update if you have any question and query regarding this please contact on tlover2054 in the instagram this is the previous video please watch this and get the free domain and try this method this much for today have a good day till our official channel like share and subscribe will value for your support thanks for watching this video thank you